Hey y'all. So we are going to do breakfast. And yeah, it's gonna be some eggs. I know it's gonna be some eggs. I'm down almost 40 pounds on that. I ain't playing, but we're gonna do stuff. Bell peppers. Yay. Let's go ahead and do that. I know some people like to what, boil it to make them a little softer first. We're not gonna boil it. We're just gonna put it inside the uh, the pan and let it you know which one do its thing. I use avocado oil today. And while these are cooking down a little bit, we got our mushrooms. And we gonna put in And we got a quarter cup of sweet onion peppers. Oh, uh, sweet, sweet onions, excuse me. I can let the pepper stay in here too long, y'all. cooking down the onions and the mushrooms because yeah they're going inside you know so it's just gonna make it better Now, but we are going to end up putting the peppers in the oven once we fill them. If it holds the filling, because it might not. I might put foil around them because they're cut kind of low. But we're going to make it happen, y'all. We're going to make it happen. I was just like, yo, I want to stuff pepper, right? And I was like, why can't I do it for breakfast? We make a breakfast one. All right, and we are going to do two cups of spinach. Y'all know I gotta put some greens in it. They're gonna cook down, but I do like to break them up. Cooking good. I know some people are saying it's harder to do it that way, but y'all, I'm. A I'm a one pot type of person. I feel like to do like a lot of things at once in one pot. And it works. Throw all the veggies in the gift. Throw them in the gift. Amigos in the background. When bad and bougie come on, I gotta pause this and go dance. Bad and bougie. <laughs> They're looking good, y'all. Yeah. What, what the thing? I'm gonna get this right. I'm better with the ice. Pepper popping. Use your utensils, y'all. Don't be like me. Cause my nails long, y'all. I got a new color. It's called Kinky Coral. I don't know what it looked like on camera, but it's like a green, a grayish green. 
right. Let me grab the seasoning. Let me get this season. All right, y'all. See? So I put it in foil. Remember I said my edge was too short. So when I pour my egg mixture, because I'm pouring, I'm going to pour it in with raw eggs. When I pour my egg mixture, it's going to fall off. So I put it into here because we ain't wasting no pepper. And I did the same one to this one so it can hold it. So let's season up. We got that crushed red pepper. That bezel. Y'all know the best way to use herbs, y'all. I'm not doing it right now, but to actually put it in your hand and crush it up. And lets the oils come out of it so you can taste it better. Just a, just a little hint if you ain't know. Um, cayenne. My onion powder. Like I said, I don't put no salt. Y'all don't use salt like that. So powder, 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 y'all. And yes, it's spicy. But you season like you want And then I got my nutritional yeast. I promise y'all this stuff's good, y'all. I think I poured too much, but the eggs got to And then right here on the side, y'all. I got the, you know, our favorite, our favorite for now. Our fresh whole bacon. This chicken bacon bomb. I don't even know how many I got left in. I got like four slices left. Remember, it's already cooked, but we're going to put it in here and let it warm up. Break it up so we can have a piece in every bite. Let me know, y'all. Is the lighting better? Hopefully so. And like I said, I got three eggs, y'all. Three eggs. We're going to do one whole and two egg whites. But we are about to let this cool down a little bit. And I got my oven running to put the peppers in the and uh, the peppers when they get stuffed into the oven. But I think you know what? We're gonna try something. We're gonna put these peppers back in here once we when we're about to fill them. We're gonna put the top on it and we're gonna let it do its thing. So let's let this cool down and we'll get the stuffing. All right, we're back and we are cooled down. This is the cheese I'm going to use. I'm going to use a cup. I'm sorry. Half a cup. Because the serving is um, a quarter of a cup. So we're going to do half a cup. I already mixed up my one egg. My one whole egg and two egg whites. And I usually do three. But cut one egg down today. Do one quarter. Two quarters, and don't talk about me, y'all, because I am bringing the plastic fork out, okay? I know some people are like, you can't use plastic forks in the thing. Hey, I got some mean one. I know I got one more thing I actually do want to put in here. And y'all, this breakfast is going to be both halves. It's yours. You can share if you like. But I'm going to tell you the calories of the whole breakfast. At the end. I want all my, I want all my veggies, y'all. Let me show you how much it is that I'm trying to get. <laughs> And you 
want to pull it down because if it's too hot, it's going to start cooking it. And we don't want it to cook. I want to add, add a laughing cow cheese because I know that's, that's my joint. Don't that feeling look good, y'all? It looks so good. I'm so ready. I sound like booba 100 times when I said that. It's getting personal. Y'all know who I'm talking about? I like watching them about the drill rappers. They be tripping, bro. Alright. Make sure this is on. We're gonna start pouring. Hopefully, we got an easy pour, y'all. And they don't try to play me on camera. And this is my first time. Well, not my first time ever making stuffed bell peppers, but my first time making it for breakfast. thought about doing some chicken breast meat something like that like sandwich meat nothing too heavy for the morning and this looks heavy but it ain't heavy y'all yes yes y'all see that Y'all see that? Them things look good. Alright. So we're going to put this on. Turn this oven off. But we're going to put a timer on for like 15 minutes. And I'm going to come back and check it. Alright, I'm coming. Alright, y'all. So we got... <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> I just smell the Kanye. Sorry. Woo. Okay. We got two minutes left on the clock. And let's see. Yes. They looking good. So one thing I did forget that I didn't show on camera that I did. I poured um, some hot water in the pan to help it steam better. These bad boys looking good. Cheesy. We're going to let it go that last little two minutes. I feel like I should put, let me see. Okay, let's see if it's coming out clean, y'all. Yep. Oh, it's cheesy. Yes. Ooh. Let me see. Once the white settle, I'm going to mix it a little bit. I want to cook just a little bit more for my liking. Because it is cheesy. It came out good, y'all. We're going to set it for about seven more minutes. Add a little bit more water and let it do its thing. All right, let's see what we got, y'all. Yes, there we go. There we go. Mm. We did that. Yeah. Here we go, y'all. Bad boy look good. Yes. Cheesy, mm, healthy, and the calories are right. <laughs> All right, y'all. Love y'all.